how to merge C drive and D drive on Windows 10 or 11. So here first if I open my file explorer and go to this PC here you can see C drive and here you can see D drive. First of all make sure that the D drive is completely empty or take a backup because this D drive is going to get formatted if we want to merge this to C drive. We do not want to format the C drive because the C drive contains important Windows files. That is why we will leave the C drive as it is and we will just drag this D drive to C drive. Now to do this what we are going to do is simply go to your search bar and search for create and format disk partitions or simply search for something like disk partitions and you'll find this setting called create and format hard disk partitions once you open this up this is the type of interface you will see now here you can see d drive of 182 gigabytes and here you can see c drive first of all what we are going to do is just select this d drive make sure it is completely empty by the way just giving you a warning that everything inside it will be deleted right click on it and then just click on the delete volume but once you click it will say deleting this volume will erase all data on this pc so we will just click yes continue and just click on the yes button now after we delete the volume what happens is that d drive will no longer exist but you have 182 gigabytes that is unallocated which means that it is not placed anywhere now we have to simply add this particular space to c drive now after you know this has been unallocated head over to c drive like this right click on it and click on extend volume now the reason the extend volume is grayed out in mine is because my disk is actually encrypted so it's not possible for me but if yours is not encrypted you have to right click on it select extend volume and when you click on extend volume you'll find a number of free space available over there and as soon as you click the next option all the remaining space from d drive will be allocated to c drive and as a result they both will be merged and this way you will be able to merge c drive and d drive on windows 10 or 11. i hope that this video helped you if you have any questions feel free to leave them down thank you for watching and see you in the next video